This is the G3 Live. Cars with curves. And we are here in Galveston, aren't we? Oh my goodness. Look at the, look, just take a look at all the vets. I mean, they're just absolutely awesome. I understand there's supposed to be a lot of Corvettes down here, and we are on the Strand today. We're on the Strand, and they've got over 30 clubs invited here, and then a ton from out of town have come in. So it is absolutely packed wall to wall with Corvettes, and I couldn't be happier. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, with the Corvettes behind us, behind this camera, there's lots more Corvettes behind the camera right here that oh you can't goodness. even see. But we'll, we'll be showing with these it's more Corvettes. Both ways. It's going every way. Exactly. I mean, they're just wall to wall. I've never seen so many vets. Exactly. Yeah. Now, uh, they're expecting how many Corvettes here today? I don't know that number. Uh, but well, there's, I do. There's, well, I do. It, there's like before yesterday, there was 500 registered, meaning they fill out the forms that they're going to be here. And you know there's going to be a bunch more show up. So oh, why didn't you tell me that? Oh, I, I am now. <laughs> Wait, see? He's always late. I don't know. I always. So, uh, roadkill. we're talking about, yes, right. I am roadkill. Road kill. You are today. <laughs> yes, I am. Yes, yes you I are. am. Yes, you now, are. there's going to be a lot more than 500 Corvettes here today. And uh, it's like, let's. They are top of the line. And, I mean, they're, they're polishing them from head to toe. I mean, they're just take great care of these cars, and as they should. I was telling Snow when she was uh, eating off my clean engines just to show you how clean it was. <laughs> so now, these engines out here on these Corvettes, these guys are wiping down these engines like they're super, super clean. And they're shining. I mean, you could eat off them. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. True, yeah, true, yeah, true, for true. Sure. For sure. And uh, with cars with curves that you're seeing here, it's like you're going to be seeing more and more and more of what we're doing with the cars with curves, with right? Curves. That's right. And all these Corvettes have curves, right? It's true. It's true. And so. most of them have the curvaceous woman that comes along with them, right? <laughs> you're hoping. <laughs> you're hoping. That's it. So... Uh, I tell you what, shall we go talk to some of these guys, the Corvettes? No, let's, let's look at some of the Corvettes cl close. Let's do. Let's, let's do, do that. Let's go. Ready? Galen's late again. We're here at the Corvette car show, and he is late again, and this is him, dead meat. I just want you to see this. Stepping on your heart. <laughs> Be on time, would you? We're here with Rick's Corvette, and just to let you know, this is what should be on the license plate. <laughs> Come here, Rick. So, somebody said two of them. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, tell me a little bit about your car. It's a 2014 Corvette, 9Z51. Uh, I've slowly been uh, modifying it or changing stuff on it to make it my personal, the way I want it. And Not this? Not that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the engine is uh, basically stock. Uh, I've stainless steeled it out Look how to, nice. make it, to make it kind of shiny and pretty. It's a little bit different than everybody else's. That is the, beautiful. Uh, the interior is basically the way I ordered it. It's uh, nothing extravagant. I bought uh, just a little bit at a time. And the last time you ran it, what would you run? 160 and climbing. Oh. What I need to know uh -huh. is what is in this fire extinguisher right here. Fire extinguisher. Sorry. Is it like, like tequila, no hard, vodka? No hard liquor. No. It's just regular old fire extinguisher. Just back, we're back to another Corvette. Come follow me around. you got to see this. we got a whole deal going on. I'm going to be Vanna White here. I'm going to show you. Check that out. People have the coolest stuff underneath the hood. This is just an immaculate engine, of course. That's a beautiful machine right there. Check this door out. Oh my gosh. It pops up. It's called a scissor door. Is it? Oh, it's a scissor door. Oh my. We're here with yet another vet that is outstanding. But look, it's got flames. And I have seen lots of muscle cars with flames on them in the engines. But check this out. This is beautifully clean. And it's got the scissor doors. I mean, can I just take this home? 
That would be really okay with me. Check this bad boy out. Okay, and spiders usually bother me. This one does not. I will take this spider with me. And I have no problem with that. Okay. This car is covered in spiders, but not the bad kind of spiders. Check out this engine. And there's no cobwebs going on in here. This is absolutely clean and gorgeous. Check out the paintwork. Impressive. Let's go to the interior. Oh yeah. Yeah. That that's beautiful work right there. Let's go to our next car. Okay. Mama, I'm sorry. She just came to pick me up, take me down. I bet she, you wish she was taking you down. Check her out. She's got the boots and everything. But better yet, check out this Corvette. It is beautiful. And it's got the B on. And I'm not real sure about all this, but <laughs> she was here, so I'm here too. <laughs> all right, let's go to the next one. Okay, now that we're with another Corvette, and I like red, since my Shelby GT500 is red, now we get a red, look at this, Z06 Corvette. And this is running like 662 horsepower, and man, it is one fast Corvette. And it is gorgeous, red with black, oh, it's gorgeous. Okay, now that we're at the back end of the Z06, which you just saw, now we've met the owner here, Lynn. And this is her Z06, and, and I, I love it that you love red because I have a Shelby GT500 and it's red. Thank you. You know, and, uh, and now look, take a look at this license plate, will you? Now, what uh, is this an actual plate that you got? I see Couture. Oh, Couture. Okay. So check out this paint job that's been done here, and this belongs to Lynn, and this is to be Lynn. Yes, yes. With the triple E's, is that what I'm saying? <laughs> No, it's, a, it's a really, it's a really great job. <laughs> Thank you, Liam. You're welcome. I'm here with John Brewster, and uh, what I was wondering was, it's unusual for a Corvette to have a supercharger. Is that correct? Well, it's not really unusual to have a supercharger on a Corvette. It's a little unusual to have a hole in your hood for the supercharger, but <laughs> check but, uh, out the hole. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> See, I think that's just the mom. Yeah, that's the mom. It huh? is. You it like is. It? I like it. it oh, well, well, tell me a little bit about your car. Well, it has a Magnuson supercharger that has roughly about 650 horsepower at the flywheel. And uh, the car's been lowered with carbon fiber ground effects and uh, uh, a Z06 rear end. There's just a ton of things done to it. I, I, I could go on and on. Yeah. <laughs> well, and that's okay. We can edit anything out you need to, yeah. but that's awesome. Yes. Yeah, I love it's the car. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful car. engine. I love the car. It's a, I mean, I've, I've been waiting all my life for a Corvette. And, uh, Me too. I, I finally, and I, I finally still don't have one. <laughs> You're going to get one. You're going to get one. It won't be long. This man's going to buy you one. Hey, check the shirt out. There you go. There right here. Silence for candy asses, baby. Do a hundred. <laughs> it's a gorgeous white and silver Corvette. First one I've seen today that really caught my eye. Let's go find out who owns this car. Actually, Tell me about your car. Actually, I bought this for my wife for Mother's Day last Whoa. year. I'm in the wrong business. Yes, you know, I, I've been real bad buying her presents, so I, I had this and <laughs> I said, Happy, happy well, Mother's Day. It's a, it's a 14 C7. C7, okay. It's just, uh, she wanted the silver stripe. The white and this and is the one of the few I've seen like this. And she wanted the matching silver. G3 Live here, as you know. Uh, this is a 65 Coupe Corvette, which is my absolute favorite. And I really just want to take this home right now. We're here with cars with curves. And I'm Snow. I'm here with Cassie. And this is her beautiful Corvette. And it's pink, and I've been looking for pink all day long. Nobody has pink here. But look at this engine. It is absolutely gorgeous. David is her husband, and it's called the Martini Girl. So give me some, give me some. It's a 2002. It originally started out as pewter. We had a little accident in Bowling Green area, and we had to repaint it, and 
this is the the outcome. This is uh, check this out is the, the outcome. It's got the <laughs> this is outstanding. Pink. There's a little martini glass here in the in the seats. I so love this. The doors come up. Oh! Flames down the side. Nice. <laughs> nice. Oh my goodness. Okay, I want one of these. <laughs> <laughs> it's just manifested into the pink. It went with the pewter. Um, it did. It goes really, really well together. I'm a big supporter of the breast cancer awareness, and it fit in perfectly. So excellent. Yeah, excellent. Cool. I have drag raced the car. I've got my helmet, matching helmet. Awesome. Well, that's great, and I truly appreciate your time. Thank been you. with us today. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Here and David, Cassie's husband, is fixing to fill us in. Well, when we decided to paint the car pink, we knew it just needed a little bit more of a muscle power if you're going to drive a pink car. So if you look down here, that large metal thing there is it's not a radiator. It's an intercooler because it's, the car's twin turbo. It has 600 horsepower. Now, in that, it's, is that unusual? It's uh, it's not that unusual. But uh, I think there's only a few of them in, in Houston area with the twin turbos. And if, if you look around back, it's a rear-mounted system. It's a rear-mounted turbo system. There's a turbo on each side. And it's piped through the rockers up to the engine. And it uh, gains about an extra 150 horsepower to the rear wheels. And that's what's fun about driving it. Now that we're fixing to end the show with G3 Live, Cars with curves, and we just met Yolanda here. Yes, nothing. And, and you're you're going to be able to see this show, and probably in about three weeks, something like that. And which channel? Uh, Carswithcurves.com. Oh, good. Nice. Do you like being on camera? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> you are now. Now Yolanda does not own a Corvette, but she. Do you like the Corvettes? I love Corvettes. My whole life. What color do you like the best? Oh, God, I want the white one, that new one. Ooh. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, now, yeah. That, now, some, with me right now. <laughs> <laughs> now, there's some Corvettes here with the same color as your sunglasses. I know. Beautiful. It's unreal. I've never seen anything like this. I'm so glad you're, they're having it in Galveston. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Galveston. So, so what we're going to do is we're going to end the show today and onward to another car show would we'll call cars with curves we're out of here <laughs>